Is this proof enough that we did tons of Black Friday shopping? <laughs> Forgot one. Hey guys, so I wanted to get on here and do a quick little Black Friday haul. I obviously can't really show you pretty much a lot of what I got today just because they are all gifts for coworkers and friends and family and all that kind of thing. So um, I did a ton, a ton of shopping today with my sister. It's our annual thing ever since I got my license um, in 2009. Wow, time's flying. Anyway, um, ever since I got my license every year on Black Friday, we take advantage of the sales and the time together, and it's just a convenient time to get tons of Christmas shopping done. We don't actually go in the little hours in the morning, just because I don't see how it's worth it. I don't want to get trampled. I don't want to die. And usually it's like, it's stuff that I don't even need or want. So we just take the day, you know, because it's convenient. I'm off of work and... It just works. So, I wanted to show you kind of the stuff I did get for myself because I couldn't resist some things. The first and best part probably of this video is the Bath & Body Works haul. Just because I needed to stock up on some of their body wash. I'm on my last one in my shower. Um, and that was from the Buy 3 Get 3 from a couple years ago. And that lasted me quite some time because I always get the free little um, versions of with the coupons. So it kind of... It lasted longer than it should have. Today, because it's Black Friday, they actually had buy three, get three on everything in the store. So I'm sure a lot of you set out for that deal in particular. I didn't know about that. I was just hoping, but we went by and saw it and I was like, yes. So instead of getting like a mishmash of everything, I just went and got my six body washes because I really needed them. But what's even more awesome is I had $13.25 left on a gift card. I had a $10 off $30 purchase and they were buy three get three so I only spent $16 even out of pocket so it's like $2.67 a bottle boom so clearly I'm pretty excited about it and I had to take advantage so let me show you real quick I kind of went crazy on the holiday scents because I had to so I got two Mary Berry Christmas this is like it just smells like grape to be honest, it kind of reminds me of my childhood. It just smells like some grapey something or other that I loved when I was younger, but I still do. And then, of course, I got two of Vanilla Bee Noel because this is my all-time favorite winter holiday scent from Bath & Body Works. This and Mary Cookie. Mary Cookie is... That's amazing, too. But they don't have that in a body wash. They have it in the candle. They have it in the hand cream. Not the body wash. Bath & Body Works. You need to make Mary Cookie and body wash and body lotion and just put it in the signature collection because it's amazing. What are you doing? Anyways, I'm very happy with those four. And then I got two from the regular collection. I got pink chiffon because this has quickly become a staple in my body wash collection. Um, warm vanilla sugar has been my all-time favorite of Bath & Body Works scent for years. I mean, ever since I was younger. But pink chiffon is quickly taken over because I, it's like sweet. It's a little heavier, so it sticks a little longer. Like, you know, it, the scent makes you smell good a little longer. But it's not too overpowering, but I really like it. And then the last one I got was Velvet Sugar. So this to me is kind of a holiday scent just because the first time I ever got this scent was in a perfume on Black Friday. <laughs> because I remember that sale was the perfume was $4 for the full size because it just came out. So... <laughs> Black Friday, gotta love Bath & Body Works. I mean, I hate the lines that, the fact that the two lines are halfway through the store, and I had to wait in the first line to check my gift card balance, and then I had to wait again to check out. So that part's no fun, but it's worth it. So anyways, got Velvet Sugar, that's my sixth signature collection body wash by 3 Get 3 sale. So, woohoo, Bath & Body Works. Then really random, but I mean, I am fortunate enough to get the the free panty coupons all the time through Victoria's Secret. I think it's because I have an angel card. My first credit card was a Victoria's Secret angel card. So just, woo, <laughs> picked up a panty because, hey, it's free. Again, had to wait in like a halfway across the store line just for a free panty, but it was worth it. Okay, so two major stops were Target and Dollar Tree today. 
Target because they have everything and I just love them a lot more than Walmart and there was no way I was going to Walmart on Black Friday. <laughs> so, and thankfully it really wasn't that crowded at Target as much as I had expected, but again, the Black Friday sales start at like 6 p.m. on Thanksgiving, so by the time we got there at like noon, it really wasn't that bad. So, got two things there. First, I got this cereal container by Cerulite. This is really random, I know, but the reason... I always have to almost drop something in a haul. I mean, that's a given. Anyways, the reason I got this cereal container is because there's a hack for having kind of a trash can in your um, car. I don't have, like, a little trash area, so I just, like... It's really gross, but it's like anything I snack on, anything I write down and have to toss out, and it, like it's, I just shove in the side door, like the little area of the side door, and I I never take it out until it's like overflowing, and then I'm like, oh, I guess I have to take this out now, and it just it's a pain for me. So I got a little cereal box. This was the smaller one because I thought I'm not gonna need the bigger one watch I'm probably gonna need it anyways so you put a shopping bag like the Target shopping bag or whatever in here and then you open it up and you're gonna just put your trash in here and when it fills up you take the bag out throw it out like any other trash bag and put a new one in it's genius the only thing that I don't know if you guys have a good hack for this the thing is they put it I'll probably show you the picture that I found on Pinterest I'll probably put it in here but it's like they put it on the passenger side floor and that works but how does it not like fall all over the place when you go over bumps and you're turning and like that's what I can't grasp is it's not heavy enough to just stay there so if you guys have a good idea for that let me know you know you're growing up when you're pretty excited about using a cereal container as a trash can in your car there's been a lot of moments today that I've realized I am adulting so this I'm pretty excited about this is by Archer Farms it's limited edition so <laughs> hot cocoa snack bites with brownie and chocolate pieces chocolate chips and marshmallows <gasps> anybody know who knows me well knows that brownies are my number one favorite dessert so it's like I see brownie, chocolate pieces, chocolate chips, and marshmallows. It's a hot cocoa snack bite, perfect for the holiday season coming up. Four dollars for this bag, which is a complete ripoff. But I figure I'm only gonna buy it once, probably twice, maybe. But it's like I had to try these, so I'm pretty stoked about these. Okay, and the last couple things I have to show you are from Dollar Tree. Again, pretty excited. So I found a pair of socks. They're not the softest and they're not the best quality, I'm sure, but I am still wearing my blue Crayola Crayon $1 socks from the Target One Spot, which I did a dollar deal video on like way back when I got that in the Crayola lip balm. I'll link that below, <laughs> but I'm, I don't know, like I'm, I'm, now that I'm getting older, I kind of want fun socks. Like I have my, like right now, I have these on, so they're just like boring black and blue socks and I really like those I prefer the black socks over white socks nowadays but I also prefer little adorable designs so and I work in early childhood so you cannot judge me anyways <laughs> these were in my size I love owls owls are like my thing it used to be cheetah it still kinda is but I I think that slowly owl and it used to be dolphins dolphins and cheetah were like my thing slowly but surely owls are making their way more and more into my life so owls adorable and they're little like reindeer owls and Christmassy and they're my size and I'm just so excited to wear these to work the day before Christmas Eve yay and the last thing is this iPad case It's a snap-on back protector case for the iPad Air I was surprised to find this because they actually had cheap plastic cases for the iPad 2 like the iPad 2 <laughs> the really old one um, if you guys know, I recently, well not recently, a year ago, I upgraded to the iPad Air 1, no, the iPad Air 2, yeah, I have the iPad Air 2, and that's what I'm filming on right now, that's what I use for my videos, and yeah, 
So I saw this and I thought this was adorable and I had to get it. And it's really cool because it's it's kind of soft, but it's not the kind that like catches tons of lint. Um, so it's like soft enough to gently go on your iPad, but still feel protected and cute. So I'm pretty excited about that. So that's my little bit of a Black Friday haul that I can show you. Rest assured, I did a ton more shopping. What you see here is like an eighth or a 16th of what I actually accomplished today and I'm very happy. I only have like a few more things that I have to get online and then I'm done Christmas shopping. Um, and then I'll just have to wrap them all, which is a struggle in itself. But, baby steps, I'm getting there. I'm almost done Christmas shopping and it's not even the end of November so I'm proud of myself. Good job. So that's my little Black Friday haul. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. I want to make sure I got it up as soon as possible for you guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.